<laughs> How do you do a video and then the voice go? So like the last one, see, I'm just letting y'all see, man. You know, this devil real, man. See, y'all think that I'm tripping. Right, but how did I turn the voice down? I don't even know if you're going to hear me on this one, so I'm just doing one, right? The people that took the voice off, and I don't, hey, I don't know how to turn the voice off, man. See, and now they want me to pay for this, right? I got to pay for the phone. I got to pay for the, uh, you know, everything, right? But now they turn it off. So now. Why should I have to pay for something that you control and you won't let me use it against you? So that isn't that this this what I see? But black folks sit up here saying I'm crazy, right? But I'm saying, man, y'all ain't seeing what these people doing. But now, what can my family do, right? See, after they done lied, right? What more can they do? See, that's what I'm telling people, right? What can you do once you don't believe? See, once you don't believe, where does that put me? Should I now not believe in me or shouldn't I believe in you? See, so I'm saying, how can I believe in your God when you don't believe in my truth? So now you want me to believe that your God going to save me but he don't need my truth to save me. So I'm saying, well, if he don't use my truth, then how would he save me? If he's not going to use my truth, what truth he going to use? Right? So now check this out. So now, so I'm a freedom fighter, right? For whom is defined as a person who takes part in a resistance movement against an oppressive political or social uh, um, establishment in the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange counties in the state of Florida on August 12th in 2008 at 10.40 in the morning, as well as in the federal courthouse in the Middle District of Florida on February 20th in 2018 at 9.20 in the morning, which is when, where, why, as well as how uh, I, uh, for whom Name is simply Tommy Chancey Council Senior, legally, historically, biblically, religiously, spiritually, financially, mentally, and federally ascended, for which is defined as to move legally, historically, biblically, religiously, spiritually, financially, mentally, and federally upward inside of the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange Counties in the state of Florida, as well as in the federal courthouse in the, in, the, in the middle district of Florida to King Tommy Chancey Council Sr. of Four Councils Incorporated is why the state of Florida, Northern United States of America are, are in accordance with the Florida Constitution, the United States Constitution, the Florida Bill of Rights, the United States Bill of Rights, the United States Declaration of Independence, statutory law, the Civil Rights Act of 1964, the Ten Commandments, the Holy Bible, nor the Holy Quran, with the dragon for whom, for which is defined as a mythical animal, usually represented as a monstrous winged and scaly old serpent, for whom is defined as a noxious creature that creeps, hisses, or stings, which is the devil, for whom is defined as a great evil, and Satan, for whom is defined as the rebellious angel who in Christian belief is the adversary of God for whom according to Christian science is defined as the incorporeal divine principle ruling over all eternal uh, spirits inside of the civil and criminal courthouses and Seminole and Orange counties in the state of Florida, as well as in the federal courthouse in the middle district of Florida. Therefore, how can the United States of America be a legal, historical, biblical, religious, spiritual, financial, mental, or federal example for which is defined as one that serves as a pattern to be imitated by other nations, territories, and countries for whom citizens seek independence, for which is defined as the quality or state of being independent, for which is defined as not subject to control by others. After I, for whom name is Petty Officer Third Class, Tommy Chancey Council Senior, legally, historically, biblically, 
religiously, spiritually, financially, mentally, and federally defended liberty and justice for all in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world with the Florida Constitution, the United States Constitution, the Florida Bill of Rights, the United States Bill of Rights, the United States Declaration of Independence, statutory law, the Civil Rights Act of 1964, the Ten Commandments, the Holy Bible, and the Holy Quran, in the midst of the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange Counties in the state of Florida, on August 12th in 2008 at 10.40 in the morning, as well as in the federal courthouse in the Middle District of Florida, on February 20th in 2018 at 9.20 in the morning, is why I, for whom simple name is Tommy Chancey Council Sr., am now wondering how can God, for whom is defined as the supreme or ultimate reality in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world, for whom is Allah, for whom is defined as God, for whom is defined as the being perfect in power, wisdom, and goodness, who is worshiped as in Judaism, Christianity, Islam, and Hinduism, as creator and ruler of the universe, in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world's human, for which is defined as consisting of or involving a human's name, for whom simpler name is Tommy Chancy Council Sr. Legally, historically, biblically, religiously, spiritually, financially, mentally, and federally become known in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world. If I, for whom name is Petty Officer Third Class, Tommy Chancy Council Sr., didn't legally, historically, biblically, religiously, spiritually, mentally, financially, mentally, and federally, oh wait, mentally, <laughs> oh, I put mentally in there twice. Well, spiritually, financially, mentally, and federally defeat Satan, for whom is defined as the angel who in Jewish belief is commanded by God to tempt humans in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world to sin, to accuse the sinners in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world, <coughs> and to illegally, historically, biblically, religiously, spiritually, financially, mentally and federally carry out God's punishment in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world, in the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange Counties in the state of Florida on August 12th in 2008 at 10 40 in the morning, as well as in the federal courthouse in the Middle District of Florida on February 20th in 2018 at 9.20 in the morning before I, for whom name is King Tommy Chancey Council Senior, of Four Councils Incorporated legally, historically, biblically, religiously, spiritually, financially, mentally, and federally referenced for which is defined as, uh, which is for which according to the Black Laws uh, Dictionary is defined as the act of sinning Revelations 12, verse 71, or directing, directing to another for information, service, consideration, or decision, especially the act of sending Revelations 13, verses 13, uh, 16 through 18. Uh, see, so now, so I'm sending you Revelations 12, verses 1 through 7 for you to study, for you to know what is going on now. So I'm going to go to Revelations 12. And then I'm going to read from Revelations 12. What the war that we are now in. See, this is a biblical war. 
that has not ended because of the lie that the devil is telling. So this is Revelation 12, King James Version of the Bible Hub edition of uh, Revelation 12, verse 7 through 12 that says, And there was a war in heaven. Michael and his angels fought against the dragon, and, and the dragon fought and his angels and prevailed not. Neither was there a place found any more in heaven, and the great, great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world. He was cast out into the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. See, so now, if he was cast out in heaven after breaking out of war in heaven, then wouldn't I then have to catch him on earth and all of his angels inside of the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange counties in the state of Florida on August 12th in 2008 at 1040 in the morning, as well as inside of the federal courthouse in the middle district of Florida on February 20th in 2018 at 920 in the morning, as well as October 10th in 2023 at 955 in the morning. See, when do you believe in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world that the dragon, that old serpent, which is the devil and Satan, is going to tell you that he did not or they did not prevail inside of the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange counties in the state of Florida on August 12th in 2008 at 10.40 in the morning or in the federal courthouse in the middle district of Florida on February 20th in 2018 at 9.20 in the morning. If the Bible tells you that the devil is a liar and a murderer from the beginning and the truth do not abode in him. So see, how do you believe that a liar who your scripture, who tells you to read it to show yourself approved, believe that a liar is going to tell the truth when your scripture says that the truth is not in a liar. So now, if you can't tell someone else's truth, then the truth ain't in you. So now, if you can't tell a truth, how you telling the truth? Anyway, but now, so now, and I heard a loud voice saying in heaven, now is come salvation and strength and the kingdom of our God and the power of his Christ for the accuser of our brethren is cast down inside of the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange counties in the state of Florida on August 12th in 2008 at 1040 in the morning, as well as inside of the federal courthouse in the middle district of Florida on February 20th in 2018 at 9.20 in the morning, as well as in hoods, projects, communities, schools, colleges, universities, churches, temples, synagogues, mosques, uh, detention centers, jails, and prisons all over the world on October 10th in 2023 at 9.57 in the morning. Okay. Um, which accused them before our God day and night. See, in judgment halls all over the world. So how can you judge my children after I judge you if you don't let my children know that you've been judged, right? So now, if my children don't know the defense that I gave my children, then how can you then charge my children and not be an aider and a better in anything my children did because you broke the, their root. And so you, so now they had nobody that they had to feel like that they had to respect. See, because once you broke their father, then you broke them from any kind of responsibility because now they see what happened to their daddy. So now, that's why I charged the state of Florida with reckless disregard of the Florida Constitution, the United States Constitution, the Florida Bill of Rights, the United States Bill of Rights, the United States Declaration of Independence, statutory law, 
and the Civil Rights Act of 1964 because the United States of America is supposed to be the parent to these documents. Damn.